everyone, welcome to the channel. So today's video is going to be haul number six, I'm pretty sure this is. Um, so I was in town and I had to do a bunch of other jobs and I just kind of thought like there's been a couple of products that I've been wanting to try that I haven't bought yet. This is kind of like the last of my to try list of like the really main stuff. Like there's a couple of other random little things that um, I one day might grab. But for now, this is like the last of like my to try list. So I just decided to go and get them. And there was one thing I also got that was requested. Um, so while I was in town, I actually ended up going to three places and I got a total of six things. Um, so I'm going to start with the thing that was requested. So I'm going to be trying these with my next period, which uh, I've just had a period. I didn't post a period vlog on that though. Um, way too busy, just lots going on. So I didn't really get the chance to do that. Um, but so I will have to wait um, about a month, but I got the Libra Goodnight's Pants. Um, these are in the size medium large, which is 12 13, which is about my size. Um, so it comes with two. And I've seen these around. I've been kind of curious. Um, but yeah, like I haven't really tried them. I hope you can see all right with this lighting. Um, yeah, so I'm going to open these up and show you what they look like. They have like a little tear strip. I don't know if you can really see that. This here will just... So these, by the way, were um, two dollars eight. Two dollars eight. So it works at a dollar forty a pair. So they look like that. They are literally like underwear with absorbency. So that is the absorbency part it's like literally like a nappy like this is probably gonna be a bit excessive for me um i don't really have that heavy of a period oh, i don't know if you can really like see that it kind of really has like a anti-leak guard type thing happening here um i'm assuming that they've got like waterproofing in them up here isn't like um waterproof that's just stretchy they feel soft like I guess that would be pretty nice. I feel like these would be more for like maternity or something. Um, yeah, I'll give them a go. <laughs> um, I don't think that they're really going to be my style. Um, but yeah, so I had a request to try those um, and do a bit of a review on them. So I will give them a go and see how they turn out. Then, so this was from Coles, by the way. I got those from Coles. They were $2.80. Then I got the Libra cotton range. So I didn't get any um, of the tampons in this range um, because I don't have mini ones. And I just have so many regular tampons already that um, I want to get through because regulars just aren't my uh, favorite. So I've got the ultra thin regular pads. So it's 100% organic cotton top sheet. Um, no dyes, no fragrances. And they're a pack of 12, they have, I'm assuming they have wings, yep, that's the back of the packaging. It says 100% organic cotton top sheet, FSC, which I don't even know what that is, certified plant-based core, no harmful chemicals, three layer body fit, shape for maximum comfort. So they open up on the top here, I'm assuming, and correct. So it's just white packaging. I don't know if you can see that. It's really faint. Um, sorry, my phone has like a privacy screen protector on it. So when I'm trying to like see from the side angle, because I have my phone on the side, I can't like see what it's actually showing very well. So hopefully that's showing it okay. Um, so they're, they're definitely like a... Um, I'm pretty sure the packaging is like biodegradable. Because it's got that like feel to it. Like that... Um, plant-based plastic feel so it opens nicely it has I think it's still maybe not necessarily roll press and grow go it doesn't quite I oh no it probably is um it just doesn't say it I don't think but it opens like other Libra pads so that's what it looks like it looks like the normal ultra thin ones but it it has that more like um that organic feel and it is actually a lot soft like I actually feel like these are going to be really nice of course that's the backs wouldn't be a Libra pad without it. Um, I actually feel like these might be kind of nice. 
the back is nice and sticky. It still only has two strips, but it's nice and sticky. So, hmm. well, it might, yeah, be kind of nice. So we'll see how they go. That's those ones, and they were three dollars fifty for the twelve pack. And then these were three dollars fifty as well, and they're a pack of twenty eight. So it's everyday protection, hundred percent organic cotton top sheet again. No dyes, no fragrance. And on the back here. It has um, no harmful chemicals and anti-bunching and the FS, FSC certified plant-based core and the 100% organic cotton top sheet. So I like their um, normal liner, so I feel like this is going to be pretty good too. It has like a weird blue strip, I don't, I'm assuming, oh that's just the backing paper, but it has like similar packaging with just really light prints on it has that same feel as the other ones for the um, but like uh, plant based plastic all oh, these feel really nice too so they look very similar to the normal Libra liners but they have like a different dotting pattern there um, and they feel really nice I feel like I'm going to love these oh they're nice okay I feel like they're going to be a new favourite uh, so then there was those. That was everything I got from Coles. Um, then I went to Big W. And so the thing that I got from Big W, I'm really curious about. It's these, which are you by Kotex Eco Pads. They're 90% biodegradable. I couldn't find anything about them on their website. I have no idea if they're just the same as the 100% cotton pads that I just bought in my most recent haul. Um, haul number five. Like, I have no idea. I've found these at Big W. They were only online at Big W. Um, I'm like, sorry, I got these in store, but I'd only seen them online in big, for Big W. Like, I couldn't find them online and even at Coles or Woolies or anything. So, like, I have no idea, but it says that they're, um, it has, like, a little thing on the bottom here, which I'm just going to read out. You both Kotex Eco Ultra Thin Pads contain 100% biodegradable fibres, which comprise 90% of the pad, including the 100% cotton cover sheet. Per biochemical methane potential test. Pad comes in a recyclable carton box and a 100% biodegradable pouch wrapper. So, like, I have no idea what these are. And I couldn't, like, I don't know whether I wasn't looking quickly on the website or not, but I couldn't find them. Okay, so they've got, um, the other ones have a cotton wrapper, whereas this is a plant-based plastic. It's very plain, it's just plain white. Has the same problems that all the Ubacodex pads have. Okay, these are tiny. Which I really think I'm going to like. So they're very similar to the other Ubacodex 100% cotton ones. But they feel softer. Like, they don't feel as rough. They look like they have that same sort of top. But they don't feel rough. And they look really small. Which I'm not complaining about because I do like that. But I'm just really confused. Like... I didn't even know those existed. Oh, whoops, well. I haven't even got a normal Euro Cotex pad here to show, but I'll have to do some sort of comparison. They look very similar. They just, for some reason, look so much smaller. Okay, well, I'll see how they go, I guess. So they were from Big W, and they were five dollars fifty. So kind of pricey, but not too bad. Um, the by the way, the Libra products were. All on special. Um, I don't know how much by. I can't remember what it said, but yeah, all the Libra things were on special. Um, so yeah, five dollars fifty from Big W. I'm really curious to see how these turn out. Then I went to Woolies, and I got. I grabbed a couple of other things while I was at Woolies, um, but I won't show what they are. But I grabbed two products. So I grabbed the. All Your Organic Initiative. I'm wondering if when I read All Your Organic on other products, I think it's the liners. I swear it says All Your Organic Intimate, but maybe that says Organic Initiative. I can't even remember. Um, but the regular pads, so they're ultra thin with wings, certified organic cotton, um, a pack of 10, and they were $6.25. I think they were for potentially on sale as well um yeah so i've seen these and i've got the liners and i've got the 
tampons. I think they're a relatively new brand. Like, I definitely don't remember them being around years ago. Um, or maybe they just went in main supermarkets. I'm not sure. But it's really nice to see more, like, organic brands popping up. And even, like, Libra and Uber Kotex trying to make um, more organic products and stuff. Or, like, more natural products. So, which I'm definitely starting to lean towards trying to um, be a little bit more natural in my choices. So, gradually. Um, yes, yeah, so these have plant-based package, plastic packaging. It's like a yellowy colour. I don't know if you can see it. But if I hold it against the box, you might be able to see that it's kind of that yellow colour. Um, feels like sturdier packaging than the other plant-based plastics, though. These are quite soft. This did not look like what I thought they would look like. I have no idea what I thought they'd look like, but that's not it. So they haven't got any like distinct core pattern. It's just for all those lines. Um, really soft actually. They definitely have that like organic feel. Like they're um not a soft like a uh, plastic feel. They're a soft cotton feel. Um. They have a nice little stick. I thought these lights should be kind of nice. They were pricey. They were, yeah, six twenty five. I think I already said that. Um, yeah, we'll see how they go. And then the last thing I got was the Tom Organic Ultralene Regular Pads. So I've got the liners and the tampons in these again. Um, but I was curious to see how these would go. So they are a pack of 10 and I paid $4.90. Pretty sure these were on special as well. Um, it's just got like a tear tab at the top here. So once again, like the liners did, it comes in like a little pack, which is kind of strange, but anyway. And this pack tears on the bottom end, I think. I swear I can see it. There's definitely a line there. Okay, there it goes. So they have the same like um, pattern. pattern. As the liners on the packaging, as plant based packaging, like plastic again. It says no pesticides and biodegradable, breathable, and hypoallergenic. Okay, these aren't very soft. They're not like. They're not like the black and gold pads that when you touch them they just feel dry. If that makes any sense. Oh, actually they kind of do. They're not like the softest out of all of them, the ones I've just opened, that's for sure. Um. But I think they'll actually still be kind of nice. So they're really thin. Yeah. See how they go. Um, yeah, so that was everything I got in this haul. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. So let me know if there's anything else you'd like to me to try out. Um, or any video requests you've got. Um, I'm thinking I might do a Q&A. So if you have questions for me, uh, leave those in the comments down below. And I will do like a Q&A video. Um, yeah, and if you have any other questions, then feel free to message me on my Instagram, which is at Aussie Periods. If you would like to me to send you some products to for free, um, then send me a message on Instagram too about that. And yeah, hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. Bye.